Hey, are you tired of hearing through your ears like a pleb? Well, why not hear through the rest of your head with these, the bone conducting headphones from Nianka. Oh, very exciting. Hi, I'm Sam Tucker and today we're having a look at the bone conduction non-plug-in futuristic tech called the Runner Pro. Thank you, Nianka, for uh, sponsoring this episode. We'll have a good time with these. These are headphones that you don't put in your ears. You put them on your, on your ear part. What's this bone? Upper, back, cheek, bone? Knee bones connected to there. Something. I'm just saying I didn't know that these things existed. Headphones that don't use ears to listen. I, I wasn't aware that was exactly a technology. And another technology I didn't quite know existed was magnetical charging. Electric magnets? Magnetical? Is that is that the, what we're calling that? F***ing magnets. How do they work? 8 gigabyte memory, so it does actually have inbuilt uh, MP3 playing ability, so you don't even need to bring your uh, Apple phone or Apple <gasps> watch or even an Android device. And it's even waterproof. We can test that. And like many products, this one belongs to Ross. Thank you, Ross, for lending us your product. Oh, of course, Donald. Well, let's just, let's just dive right in. One thing I have to say is uh, the packaging is quite nice because you can see it sparkles there in the light. Very nice and sparkly. It makes me wonder what would Apple products look like if you went to the Apple store and they just handed you a big Ziploc bag that had the iPad in it. It wouldn't quite have the same effect. So, so far so good. The packaging is very nice. Be open. Yeah, is that the incantation to open this thing? Be open. Be it. Oh, oh it works. There we go. Very nice. Accessories. Not today. We'll have a look at accessories in a sec. Let's just get right to the bang and bazoogle. You might be wondering, Sam, why would you need these um, impressive uh, Magneto tech? Yes, Magneto, I believe, had the prototype for this um, headphone technology. I think he was listening to <gasps> Madonna in the toilet. Dirty. Good man. So you might be wondering why get this super fancy tech rather than just normal headphones that go in your ears, the normal listening part of the body. Many reasons, all right, and one of them is for safety. You might be out there doing your eczema sizes and you might um, see cars and that, and you might also want to listen to them. Well, now you can listen to the cars and your music because your ear ports are nice and clear. Isn't that right? Eh, eh, up, up, upstairs. I think we might need a couple of accessories. Let's open the accessories compartment. Ah, oh, it's a pull tab. Okay, that's why it's empty. Very nice, and again, embossed in gold looking font. Okay, what do we have here? <laughs> yes, and these, these to really prove the point that these um, don't use your ears, you should plug them up. You can actually put plugs in your ears. That's another reason. I saw on the website they can use these for swimming. These can be swimming headphones because they're waterproof. Okay, what the heck is this <laughs> squiggly thing? Isn't this one of those Pokemon? Those um, unknown Pokemon or something? We caught one! We caught one. This accessory includes an adjustable silicon cord which you can use to adjust the tightness of the headphones. That's okay, I think I've got a pretty fat head so... We might need all the space we can get, but it's good to know that it also works for small heads. Here's the charging connector, and here is the, <gasps> yes, it's the, what was it called? Magnetical, yes, it's the magnetical connector, which magnetical's right on here, just like so. No, it's, it's repulsing. <laughs> it's doing the opposite that a magnet should. I think I got it on the wrong way. There we go. Okay, that's cool. I haven't used an Apple Watch. Is that the same thing that happens with Apple Watch? If you put it in the wrong end and it says no. That, that's what happens when you try to use an Android charger on a um, Apple Watch. It just, just repulses it. Hopefully these came with a little bit of charge because I want to get right into the business. Actually, how do we turn this on? Good thing we have instructions. Ah, microphone. Okay, so these can also be used to take calls and stuff. All right, very cool. Okay, volume down, volume up, and the power button, and the mode button. How do I know when it turns on? Because I can't do anything. Oh, it's vibrating. Oh, enter the Bluetooth mode, it said. I'm now one with technology. Okay, so maybe I'll try connecting it to a Bluetooth thing. Let us try an iPhone. Nianka, there's Nianka. Oh, wow, that's interesting. There's a, you can hear it, and it said, the Bluetooth is connected. There is someone talking. I'm hearing voices in my head. There is a pleasant woman voice in my head. Girlfriend will not be happy about that. Let's find a, a musical clip. Oh, turn the volume up. I can hear the advertisement. This is Black Mirror. I can hear the ads in my head. Okay, so this is interesting. It, it's kind of just like having headphones, but it's not attached to my ear. Hmm. So if you have a listen, 
you can kind of still hear it. <laughs> okay, so the technology isn't breathtakingly futuristic, but it is still quite snappy. Let's now compare that to some other headphones and see what they would sound like by comparison. Here is the uh, space technology, just being nearby. And now here's a pair of um, just any earbuds, what that sounds like. So you can kind of tell the, the difference there, but the main point that I find is that I can listen to the same music and I've got full oral capacity. I can fully hear everything. It does speech jam myself when I listen to my own music and also try to ex explain the nuances of headphones, but compare that to some earbuds and I, I, I'm cut off. I'm cut off from the world. I could crash, I could die, I, I could, I could, I could get squished by a car, and but that's not what you want. But now what you're wondering, what the big benefit is, if your ears are free, does that mean that you can listen to two songs at the same time? Let's try that out. We've got the, the, the brain vibrators and the ear pluggers. Let's see which song wins out and if my head explodes. Oh wow. <laughs> You can hear both. <laughs> you can do your own uh, DJ mix in your own head and um, and then you will get uh, run over by a car if you focus on that. It's a little strange, it's, I, I, it's hard to describe. What would happen if I just put them in my ears? That does work. So you could just put them in your ears if you, if you want to go the old school way, but if you put them over your ears, it's like it's enhanced by your skull. All right, let's try a podcast, let's try audio. Yeah, so voice sounds good on them too. All right, so here's my thoughts on, on the audio quality of these. They're like an all right pair of head of earbuds that you might get, like they come with the Apple, they used to come with an Apple phone, they don't anymore, do they? Courage. But they come with the awesome benefit of being able to hear everything around you. Because if you want something like that, the only thing I can think of is those, those open back, big set of headphones, which is no good for when you're running and about doing your push-ups, doing your doing your, your, your squats and your and you crossing the road, you get pretty decent audio quality. Of course, it's not gonna be as good as the Apple Pro in your ear noise canceling thing. These are like the opposite of noise canceling. You wanna let in all the noise of your surroundings. Nice and light, so you're not gonna weigh your head down with this thing. And um, I don't know about you, but I think it's kind of inconspicuous. What do you reckon? Especially if you have some hair like mine. People aren't really gonna notice that. And very sturdy as well, very strong and sturdy. You can kind of flex and schmex them all around. Cool. Very good fitness uh, headset, so I guess the only thing now to do is to try them out in the real world with something that I don't, well I don't do very often, with some fitness. Ah, oh, let's try it out. What a good exercise. What a fitness fitness idol I am. Um, so there you go, the Bone Conduction headset by Nanka. Link in the description if you wanna check them out. Very cool, they work as advertised, which is how you'd like most of your products to work. Yeah, this is like an awesome solution for when you wanna be able to hear your surroundings and also do some, do some activities as well. All right, so until next time, this is Sam Tucker saying, stay funky everyone, and I'm gonna to listen to Madonna. Actually, no, that, that sounds like a fate worse than death at this point. She's almost death herself. The the grim repress. Well done Madonna for holding on all this all this time. It's it's not an offense to make fun. It's not ageist. She she is old. Oh well. Until next time. Same time signing off. Subscribe today. Funk it down. <laughs> Is that it? Yes.